What's up everyone? Welcome to your 30 minute no repeats upper body workout. Grab two sets of dumbbells and let's get started. What's up everyone? Welcome to your upper body no repeats workout. Let's go ahead and get you set up so we can rock right into the warm up. You're gonna need two sets of dumbbells today, okay? A lighter and a heavier. For myself, I'm gonna use 20s and 10s. If you have adjustable weights, I will make sure that we're using the heavier weights at one time and then the lighter weights at one time. But just go ahead and make sure you have two options for yourself. For me, like I said, 20 and 10, and I will group them together so you're using the same weights at the same time, okay? Also, if you wanna grab a bench, we have dips and we have chest flies that I will use my bench for. So go ahead and grab that and your water and your sweat towel. And let's go ahead and jump into the warm up, okay? Here we go, big cross over your chest. In four, three, two, one, let's go. Good, lift your chin. Very excited for this format. A big giant set today, and that's what we're gonna start the week off with. A giant set week with a no repeats workout. Three, two, one, good. Take just the left arm, open, cross. As you cross, lean over just a bit. Good job, two more, then switch arms. Just over 23 exercises to work through today. Two, and one, arms past your body and up. When you go up, thumbs point back, so you're getting a good stretch here. Three, two, and one, good. Let your arms hang straight down. I want you to squeeze your shoulder blades together. Three, two, one. Good, stand up from here, hands together, bend and straighten. Good, when you're bending, same thing, good stretch in the triceps. Three, two, one. Good, arms up overhead, pull side to side. Two, one, all right, bring it down, roll your wrists. We're gonna start off in 10 seconds, inchworm push-ups, okay? So you're walking it out, you can go onto your knees or onto your toes, one push-up, and then walk it back. 40 seconds on the clock, let's go! One round for every exercise, so make it good. Tight core. Good job, just about 10 more seconds and then we'll rock into those heavier weights. I'm gonna grab my 20s. One more, three, two, one, rest. Good, we're going into bent rows. Okay, so you're coming right here. All right. Actually, let's stand these up. Let's go right here, okay? Three, two, one, let's go. And by the way, if you wanna do them on the ground, you can, but let's do a double arm rep for this one. And make sure when you're lowering, you're not just totally relaxing. Great job, 15 seconds. Two more, four, three, two, one. Good, staying with this weight. Arnold Press is next. Dumbbells are here, you're coming out, up, down, middle. Okay, same weights here, or your heavier end. Let's go, five seconds. Three, two, and we're off. Good. 
Good job. 20 more seconds. One more, two, one, good job. Bring those dumbbells down to your side. Hammer curls, okay? Elbows stay neutral, pull and lower. And if you need to adjust your weights, go ahead. All right, we go in seven seconds. Exhale, a little bend in your knee. Let's go. Good job, come on. Keep the elbows close. That's it, you're doing great. We're gonna hit dips after this, okay? So, be ready to rock into your bench or if you don't have a bench, you can just use your dumbbells on the floor to get yourself off the ground a little bit. Two, one, and rest. Good job, dips are up next. And then after dips, we're gonna rock into our lighter weight. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab my tins. Just put them out here, okay? If you don't have a bench, you can go down on the floor just like this. Okay, two, one, let's go. Good job, if you're able, you can straighten your legs out. Good work. Five. Two, one, all right. Moving on to your lighter weights. We've got chest flies. You can go on the bench or on the ground. Okay, and we're gonna move into 45 seconds of work. Lighter weight, all right. Here we go, six, five, right here. Two, one, let's go. Good stretch, good control. Great work, exhale. Good, 15 more seconds. Four, last one here, three, two, one. Come on up, you're staying with your light weights. Back flies, okay, hinged here. A little bent arm, okay, squeezing back. Grab the weights that work for you. Two, one, let's go. Think about your shoulder blades meeting together in the middle of your spine, halfway down your spine. Good job. We're pushing and we're pulling today, but only one round for every exercise. So do it well. There you go, four. Two, one, good job. We go to lateral raises. A little bend in the elbow again. Right here, right out to the side. Okay, seven seconds. Three, two, one.
Good job. Nice work, just over 15 seconds to go. And then we'll hit one more lighter exercise. Lighter dumbbells. And then we'll switch it up. You're doing great. Six. Last one together, two, one. All right, front raises, okay? Want your thumbs up, right beside your legs. No one here. Pause by your thighs, okay? Let's go, four. Three. And we're off. Good. You're not swinging. Stop by your thighs. You want to feel it right here in your anterior deltoid. Lift the thumb. Slowly lower the thumb. And keep this little bend in your elbows. Good job, I'm with you. Seven. Three, two, one, and rest. And I lied, we've got one more lightweight exercise. Sorry about that, tricep kickbacks. Right here. Then we'll switch it up, okay? Let's go in four, two, one, come on. And when I feel the best connection to my triceps on this one, it's when I keep my elbows up, okay? If I start to get tired and I drop my elbow on the way down, I'm not getting as much of a stretch and extension for my tricep. Keep your back strong, keep your chest open, and keep your elbows up. Good job, 10 more seconds. Then we drop the dumbbells. And rest, good. Light dumbbells out of the way. We're going pike push-ups. All right, if you're not ready for a pike push-up, you're gonna give me a pike shoulder tap. If you can, you're gonna go down and up. Ready? Two, one, let's go. Hips are up in the air. There's a straight line from your head to your hips. Elbows go out to the side. Great job, 20 seconds. Nice job, breathe. Think about pushing the floor away from your head. Five, two, one, good job. We're going back to our heavies, alternating bent rows, okay? So same thing, coming down to the floor. Same dumbbells. Ready? Three, two, one, let's go. A little bit different. You can speed these up a little bit more than if you were standing and doing them both arms at the same time. Good job, 15. Five, stay right here when you're done. Two, one, good job. We're kneeling, alternating shoulder press. Right here. Okay, seven seconds, sticking with the heavies. Five, two, one, let's go. Good. Keep your core nice and tight.
Nine. One more, three, two, one. Good job, come on up, alternating curls. Okay, as you curl, you're gonna walk to that side. So you curl, curl, okay? Same dumbbells, your heavier set. We go in three, two, one, let's go. Here, step, curl. Keep just a slight forward lean in your chest, okay? So when I step here, all right, just a little forward lean. Good job. Another 15 seconds and we're gonna take our halfway break so you can grab water. Okay. 10 seconds. One more each arm. Four, three, Two, one, you've got 30 seconds to rest, okay? Pause it here if you need to. Whew, and we're going back to our lighter weights. Whew. All right. So 15 seconds, chest fly pulses, okay? So you're gonna stay open and halfway up. Let's go together in six. Two, one, come on. 45 seconds again. You're doing great. So we had a little unilateral set. We've got some pulses here. Lots of good challenges for you throughout this workout. Stay with me. Knowing that you're there working hard is pushing me to work hard too. So let's go. Good job, 15 more seconds, come on. Right around the ribs. Four, three, and rest. And if you're sitting or laying on something, you can do this here. Okay, if you're not, we're just standing, alternating back flies. Okay, so we're here, boom, and boom. But if you're seated, feel free to take it here. Ready? Two, one, let's go. Totally up to you. Nice work. Almost there, seven, six, two, one, good job. Stand up, lighter weights, keep the same weights here, okay? Alternating lateral raise. We're gonna think of a pendulum, okay? Palms face forward. You go here, tap, here. Ready? Two, one, let's go. Good work. 30 seconds to go. Strong shoulders, come on. 15. Two, one, 15 seconds, we're going alternating front raises, okay? So as you raise, that same side leg kicks back. So you go here, boom, here, okay? Little bit of a cross, all right? Lighter weights, stay right here. Three, two, one, lift it up, just a little cross. If you don't wanna do the, to, uh, the foot tap or the toe tap, totally fine. You can just take it right here. The only real benefit 
of the toe tap is just a little bit of core activation, not too much, okay? But as you shift from side to side, just refocusing, restabilizing your core, okay? The main focus is, of course, shoulder. Good job, come on, let's go. Five, two, one, drop those dumbbells. We're going Superman. Lay it down on the ground. Whew. Good work, 30 second rest here. Then we'll enter into the last exercise group. Okay, so another 15, grab water. We've got combos, a Superman, and then we go into combos, okay? Eight seconds, you're gonna lift your chest up, pull back, palms face each other, then they reach out forward. Three, two, one, let's go. Good job, stay with me, you're doing great. Good, you should feel this in your back muscles. You got 10 more seconds here. And your lats as well. Two, one, and rest. Good job, coming up. We're back to our heavies. Curl and press right here. Boom, boom, okay? Seven seconds. Curl and press. Two, one, let's go. Good job, a full minute for these combos, by the way, and we'll take 15 seconds rest in between, but the full 60 here instead of 45. Since there's two parts to every exercise. Good, second half, let's go. I know your arms are feeling this. They should be, you're working hard. Don't underestimate how much your core is involved in this as well, especially in the combos. Make sure it's engaged. Nine. Let's go one more. Four. Two. One. Great job. Lighter dumbbells. Go to your lighter end, okay? Tricep kickback and back fly. So you're going here, down, fly, down. Okay, let's go. Three, two, one. Kick it back, boom, release, and then fly. Good job. Non-stop work here for 60 seconds. Good, you're done with your first 30 seconds. Ten. Almost there, six, five. Two, one, rest for 15, and you've got chest fly and bent arm skull crushers. Okay, so we're here, come up, bend beside your ears, come up. Ready, come on, you're doing great. Three, two, one, let's go. I know this is a double tricep. Lots of focus on the triceps today intentionally, okay? <sighs> Had a lot of people talking about they wanted to really feel the firmness and the strength in their arm, and the tricep makes up about two thirds of your upper arm muscle. So we're really hitting them hard today, and we will continue to do that throughout the next month. <sighs> Good. 
Good job. You got about 25 seconds. Good job. Seven, six. Good job. Give me two more reps. Two, one, and breathe. Head up to your heavier weights. All right, row and curl. We're gonna go row, left, right, curl, left, right, okay? We go in five. Left arm, right arm, left arm, right arm. Two, one, let's go, row, row. Step together, curl, and curl. That's your next minute. Good job. Good, nine, eight, three, two, one, rest. Okay, 30 seconds rest. You have an option here. Two exercises for a freestyle at the end. You pick your favorite push exercise, meaning you use your chest and your triceps, and then we'll pick our favorite pull exercise, meaning your back or your biceps. Or you can pick a combo move. Anything that we've done today, you've got two exercises to pick to do for 60 seconds, and then we're done, okay? So push exercises first. I'm gonna go with some chest flies, okay? Pick yours. Let's go, two, one. As soon as you get into it and get ready, go for it. If you start a couple seconds late, we'll have rest, okay? Just go a couple more reps. Good job, and be thinking about the exercise that you want to finish with. Back and biceps, so you've got curls, you've got rows. Or you've got any of the combos that we did today. Twenty seconds, come on. Good, come on, push, push, push. This is it, you've got seven, six. Two, one, good job. 15 seconds rest. Whew. Your last exercise is gonna be something with your back or your biceps. I'm just gonna go rows on the floor. Okay, I'm really working hard on my back strength. Let's go together. Three, two, one, come on. Good, focus, come on. This is your choice exercise, so I need to make sure you're going as hard as you can. Last 30. Fifteen, come on, come on. Five, three, two, one. Before you stand up, give me two push-ups and then you're done. Two really solid push-ups, your best ones, okay? Go for it. And we are done. You've made it to your cool down. Amazing job. 
Take your right arm up, grab onto your left, pull it overhead. Beautiful job today. Hopefully you felt in that last part of that workout, okay, I'm really getting stronger. With those two exercises that you picked, I wanted you to feel good about what you were doing and what you were working for. Okay, switch it over. Other side. Nice job today. Way to start your day, way to start your week. Go ahead and pull fingertips back. I know we were holding dumbbells for a lot of the workout today, so great job. Hope you had fun with this workout and I hope the lighter and heavier sections or groupings really helped you kind of stay with it. Okay, switch. I'm always looking to make sure your workouts are your best. And so however I can do that for you, I wanna make sure you get these heavier weights and you go hard with them, okay? You get your lighter weights and you work for more time, more tension. All right, pay, uh, put your palms facing down to the floor. Take your ear over to the shoulder. Good job today. And exhale. Good work. Hands together, take them up, 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 and bend your elbows. Reach your thumb back for your cervical spine, right around the top, right under your neck. And then open your chest up just a bit. Good, straighten it back up, exhale. Drop your arms down, amazing work today. Very proud of you. Make sure before you head out today, you comment below and let me know what your favorite exercise was today. I'm interested so I can actually see what I wanna program in more for you. Was it triceps? Was it a kickback? It was a chest fly, whatever it was. I wanna hear what you vibed with, what you felt good in, what you wanna do more of, so I can make sure to include that in your future programming, okay? Have a great day today. Don't forget, you are crushing it. Keep crushing it outside of this workout too, and I'll see you tomorrow.